Hello friends, um, I am Parvez and this is our fifth video in developing Qt Quick applications uh, with QML and Qt5. In the last video we have covered the basics of uh, mouse area in QML and this was from the previous video. Uh, and in this video we are going to cover uh, properties in QML. Uh, for this I want to make a new file or project uh, from the application, choose Qt Quick Applications and give a name. I give it to my property. My property. Next, next, next. Uh, now, if you run this my property, you will see a simple application, simple window. Okay. Now open your uh, from our source your main.qml uh, and remove this text. Also give a width and height to your to your window. I give it 600 and height is 500 and a color of uh, blue. Uh, now if I run this, you can see that we have a blue. Uh, window. Now I make a rectangle like this. Uh, I give a width of uh, 300 and a height of 200 and a color of mm, red. If I run this, you can see that we have a simple red rectangle. Okay, now what's property in QML? A property is a simple key value. Uh, for example, uh, like this, we have width 300, height 200. Uh, it's a key value. And property is like this. Uh, and also, a property has a well defined uh, type and uh, can have an in initial value. Uh, in property, we have a type. For example, we have int type, we have uh, like a boolean type, or we have a string type. Now, okay, uh, we are going to make our property. For this, I want to make a new uh, Qt Quick file, and I call this my rectangle, <coughs> like this. Okay. Now I am going to cut my this rectangle code and copy this in my rectangle okay like this okay uh, now I give uh, mm, let me just once check my uh, rectangle file okay now I want to give an ID to my this item I give it a rec and I give some properties. The first one is int property and I give it rect width. I don't want any value in here but you can give value. Another property I want int uh, rect height. I remove the value and another property I give it string of rect color like this okay uh, now I want to remove this I give it uh, sorry rectangle dot uh, rect with rectangle dot rect height and rectangle dot rect color. Okay. Uh, now, if I remove this, because uh, I have uh, defined my rectangle in here, uh, if I run this. You will see there is nothing. And if I give uh, 
my rect and if I run this you can see there is nothing uh, because uh, now we have defined our uh, width, height and color in here you can simply write rect width to um, I give it uh, 400 and uh, rect height to 300 and also I give rect uh, color to yellow if I run this Mm, let me check this. I have a problem here. Uh, my rectangle. Oh, sorry. I make a mistake because I had a uh, another file in here. Mm, because we are working in this file. And mm, okay, I have make a mistake. Sorry. Okay, now in here uh, we have uh, defined our rectangle. If I run this, you can see there is nothing. Uh, and call your my rectangle. If you run this, there will be nothing. But you can add your rect width to uh, 300 and rect height to 200 and rect color to yellow you can see that we have a rectangle let me uh, inter um, des describe again because I made a mistake I have a, um, a folder uh, another project at name of property <coughs> basically what we have done for the property uh, I made another uh, my rectangle file uh, okay and I define some properties in here uh, for my width for my height and for my color also and here in my rectangle I give them by ID rectangle dot rect width rectangle dot rect height and rectangle dot rect color okay now in my main QML I want to set values to my these properties like this rect weight, rect height, and rect color. Simply, uh, if you run this, you can see that we have a simple rectangle. Also, you can give uh, x position and y position. You can make properties, but I give in here. I give the x to 200 and the y to 200. Uh, now, if I run this, you can see that we have rectangle in here. Okay. Uh, one important issue in properties. Uh, when you are defining property, make sure that uh, the first letter of uh, your property uh, name should be lowercase. Because if I change this to rect weight and uh, I change this to rect weight, um, you can see that I will get an error. If I run this, you can see uh, property names cannot begin with an uppercase this is an important issue and you should uh, give it a small and later like this and I change this like this and now if I run this there will be no problem cannot I'm sorry I make problem with it Okay, uh, because I have uh, an open project like this, uh, if I close this, you can see that my property is still running and it's not showing in here. Okay, uh, this was our fifth video. If you, you have any question, please let me know. And for the further videos, please subscribe my channel.